Uh, welcome to another video from Dr. Locke. Uh, in this video we're going to do an update on the Lonsdor K518IC. Now um, I've got battery power here, I've got 78% battery power. Moving over here I've got Wi-Fi because I've hooked it onto my home network and all the rest of it you can't see I've got a messy bench. So I just used it but the thing is with these machines you've got to keep updating them all the time there's always something new one of the features I do like about this machine is just that um, you can update it quite easily well once you're in range of your Wi-Fi and you just turn it on I'll go back to the home menu actually very home home okay so that's pretty much your home menu um, update firmware settings special functions adapters od uh, one key update that's what we're going to do had a little red dot next to it so obviously there's something new there check for updates the current um, program version update check api blah 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 well let's go with the one that had the little dot on it so we just push the push the button and away we go oh so there's a whole heap of new stuff added there um, we're now in January 2019 so we've got uh, October 25th 2018 all of these new things I'll just read through some of them because this will give you an idea of the caliber of uh, the updates uh, Fiat Asia Fiat uh, Middle Eastern Fiat South America Fiat select from type immobilizer so there's a lot of Fiat in there Fiat Europe this is just one of the updates. This is why it's important to keep them updated. Renault, select from vehicle, Clio, Escape, Kangaroo. We got the kangaroo here, the kangaroo van, and real kangaroos. Renault, Renault, Renault. Okay, so there's a whole heap here. Is there a button down the bottom here to? To say go for it geez that's a it's quite a lot there so let's just push the button and get it started downloading database so this will go on now for probably 10 or 20 minutes so I'm not going to keep you waiting uh, while that does but it's one one button update and that's one of the things I do like about the machine one button you get the latest of updates they keep up uh, doing updates as well so it's not like um, you buy the machine they've got your money they actually are doing updates one of the things I did do with this machine is um, uh, originally I, I had a problem with it and I posted a video and they actually called me and they said oh look you know what's wrong with it try this try that so they actually uh, seems like a machine that they're going to be supporting and it's not one of those machines Chinese machines you buy and then you're sort of stuck somebody did say um, did say that there might be updates that you've got to pay six hundred dollars a time I haven't found that at all I haven't used it full, to its capas, fullest capabilities yet but for what I have used it it does seem to be a pretty cool tool uh, good for the arsenal so this one key update is easier than the MVP um, you don't have to log in and do all this rubbish you just find your Wi-Fi push the one key update and you saw some of the calibers of those updates they're really good so as they keep adding things to it um, it becomes a better and better and better machine um, when they find bugs they seem to be fixing it so you are getting some sort of after after market updates and support in that regard if you've got any questions about this machine contact Lonsdor I'm not an end, um, end seller I'm not a service uh, sorry I'm not a technical support person I'm pretty much just like you guys just a user and I'm trying to use it to uh, find out what it can do and where it can benefit me as a locksmith so if you've got questions ask them not me and um, yeah keep your machine up to date it's just doing the update now as you can see it's already 25 percent so one key update um, easier than the MVP I haven't used the XTool update so I can't compare it against that but some of the updates I did see in there uh, were, were pretty cool to have on the machine so obviously they're trying to compete in the market and obviously they're adding things to keep it as relevant as possible so that's how to update the Longstore K518 ISC and once it's finished I'll have a machine that's up to date completely and then from there any of those new things that they've added I'll be able to to use them if you do find any bugs email uh, Lonsdor because if you email Lonsdor it all helps every locksmith that emails Lonsdor a problem or something they then can check it out and they can fix the bug or they can do it on the next update and that just helps everyone so yeah um, 
as far as updating I would give it uh, oh, out of five I'd give it a five because it's been the easiest as soon as I get home it's got my Wi-Fi I've got a battery boom and we're ready to go okay thanks for watching